welcome back to my channel guys this is mando predator if you're all new to this channel watching this this video and stuff make sure you all like and subscribe hit the notification bell if you're all into gaming reaction videos movie and tv show reviews so today we're doing a movie review and today's movie review we're doing is <sighs> finally Batman and Robin, let's just get this over with. So this is basically another Joel Schumacher film, and then we basically have still Crystal Donna's Robin again, and then we have George Clooney as Batman in the same armor like in Batman Forever. This ought to be interesting. Not. So basically, I saw Rob Batman and Robin when I was like eight, and then I liked it at the time. It was so fun. But when I realized as an adult now when you watch this movie, this movie was so bad. It was just garbage and everything. And then we basically got a cool, we got some like three new villains. We got Poison Ivy played by Uma Therma. We got Mr. Freeze played by Arnold Schwarzenegger. And also we have the terrible Bane they did for the movie. And wasn't much fighting and stuff for the Bane character. Even though they still put that cool like view, view camera view of CGI Gotham City and it just looks horrible horrible like i really like in the old batman movie they did a map painting of gotham city it was a map painting of gotham city in the tim burton batmans and they were off and looked really awesome back then they used to do map paintings from like 70s and 80s movies for like a setting like in new york or like on a like on a visual shot of like people on there it's just really awesome how they do map paintings for like movies and stuff but they don't they don't make them like that no more and also it was okay for the story how like batman and robin work together and then we got a bat girl played by elisa silverstone and i found out like elisa Silverstone didn't really like wearing that bat girl costume how she regret playing as bat girl in the in the joe schumacher film yeah, I was pretty disappointed with too. To tell you the truth, this is kind of worse than Batman Forever, but I kind of did like Batman Forever because of the song Chris by Rose and stuff by Seal. That's the thing I enjoyed and stuff, but this was just way, this is just worse, like for the villains in this. It's just so bad. And also, I don't have much to say about this movie. It was just so bad. I did not like this, like, I just did not like the characters. And the actor in this movie because it's just not the same but at least they brought back the actor who played alfred in one of those other three movies and stuff well that was all right that at least they didn't change that starting off i'm gonna have to give um batman and robin a probably a two out of ten of this movie i did not like it i did not like the individual effects in that movie the villains on those we're we're terrible. I love the actors, but I didn't like the villains in this movie, movie as they how they were designed and stuff. I did not like the bat suit, and I did not like those bat suits and the Robin suit because and the Batgirl suit because the suits on there were just horrible. Like they just ruined, they just ruined it. Like it's just so bad. So that's gonna be it for today's channel, you guys. Make sure you all like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, follow me on my social medias, and this is Mando signing off.